If any one of you, if any one of you have think about the global issues, the issues that your country, your people, your nation is facing right now, I can bet you, you will manage to resolve those issues from your heart. And one day, definitely come in your life that your parents, your people, your nation, your country will definitely proud on you. And the platform is here. The platform is World Youth Summit because World Youth Summit is promising you to creating a bridge between the underprivileged areas, underdevelopment countries, developing countries, and the developed nations. We are gathering people across the world because we all are same. We all are human. There is something which is really common. It's the humanity. We all are working for the humanity. We all are working for the human rights. Because at the end of the day, we bleed with the same color of blood. That is right. Because we all are common. We all are into the same stage. But again, it is your responsibility. And I can assure you, this day is going to be created a great history in your future. Because you're going to be the next leader of your country who is going to rule your country. The better man for the youth and for the people of the country. Welcome to South Africa. Welcome to the Johannesburg. And welcome to the University of Wurzburg. I am very much thankful to all of you that you travel all the way from your country. I know there are plenty of other people who really want to come, but they have some constraints. I am really much thankful to the Department of Home Affairs. Every single day, they are working, they are doing their level best to providing you guys a platform. And they did an amazing job. I am really thankful for that. Once again, I'm thankful to the Wits University. They are supporting since day one, side by side, shoulder to shoulder to us. And the government of South Africa, really, really thankful for that. Thank you very much. It's an honor to host you as the World Youth Summit Active. Thank you very much. Very passionate welcome, Mr. Ali Papalanda. And we can now to change the title of So you've heard from the men on the floor. Let's give it up for the Deputy Minister of Women, Youth and Persons with Disabilities, the Honorable Professor Fengiro Kizu.